Hi, this is Kevin from Reese Roofing at 11 Summerfield in Princeton, New Jersey, doing a repair attempt and an inspection at 11 Summerfield, Princeton, New Jersey. Um, first, that there are already prior repairs on this roof, um, and those prior repairs have damage to the surrounding shingles. Um, this is evidence that this roof isn't repairable without causing further damage. Um, additionally, we found a significantly mo more damage than your company found. Um, on the back slope, we found about 55 damaged shingles. Um, this is including all those missing. Um, there's also another prior repair down there that you can see there's damage to the top of those shingles. Um, we're going to do a repair attempt on that shingle right there. Um, on the front left slope, we found two. Front and right slope, we found eight. And on the front slope, we found seven. Now, I know this front slope is hard to see because of the allergy, but some of them are pretty apparent. You can see that crease right there. Um, other ones are a little more hidden. But this one you can see pretty good too right there. Um, this one is a little harder to see, um, but it is right here. You can see it right in the resolution. Um, uh, based on what I see up here, I don't think um, all the damage was found. Um, but let me do this repair attempt and then we will Go from there. This is the shingles before the repair. Blow up my phone off the roof.
So here are the shingles above it. After just getting the nails out, you can already see a crease is forming here, one right there, a little bit right there, a little bit right there. Um, but let's finish the repair. Uh, but so far, it's already evidence that damage will be caused from it. So, as you can see, there's creases forming along the top of these. I don't know if you can see it. Let me see if I turn this around. So there's a crease right there, and there's one starting there, another crease, and I don't think these shingles can be repaired uh, without causing further damage. Additionally, these shingles won't be able to reseal back down because we broke the seal. There's additional holes from the nail holes, nails that we couldn't use. The nail holes can't, we couldn't reuse them because they were too big after we pry out the shingles, uh, the nails. And uh, so that's more water entry points. These won't reseal back down. They won't perform the way the manufacturer intended. Additionally, uh, these over time will deteriorate much quicker than they were supposed to. So we're essentially hurting the policy holder by trying to repair one shingle at the expense of one, two, three, four, five, six, seven shingles. It's a one to seven exchange per repair attempt. Um, so I don't think this roof can be repaired. It must be replaced because it's a domino effect.